What's happening, folks? Back with another reaction, and we're back with the final tune on Madonna's 1984 album, Like a Virgin, though I should mention there's a, an extended dance remix of both, um, what is it, Material Girl and Like a Virgin, um, included in this expanded edition um, for the folder I have access to. So once again, big shout out to Mark. Um, and yeah, I really enjoyed Pretender. That was a fantastic song. It seems like a number of people did as well. Um, and yeah, ultimately, uh, it's a tune that has stuck in my head in the last uh, several days, so um, a testament to that track. Uh, and the final tune is called Stay. It's a single word title. Those do tend to be tougher to get a read on, um, just because there's no context. So the concept of stay, it makes you think about a relationship and maybe a plea or an entreaty to someone who might have one foot out the door because maybe they feel like the relationship isn't rewarding or wor worthwhile anymore, but the other person is trying to convince them um, that there is still a meaningful connection available. They just have to perhaps work at it or try to um, reinvigorate it or um, rectify it. So um, yeah, that would be my immediate guess. Obviously stay, it could relate to someone's connection to a particular place, whether it's their home literally or their hometown or the place they grew up, or um, it could relate to some other um, desire not to see motion toward or from and so on, uh, but out of the gate and without any other context, that would be my assumption that it's a plea from one partner, maybe former partner to another, not to give up on what they've had. So let's find out if that's in any way uh, running in the right direction. This is Madonna, the tune is Stay, and as far as I can tell, it's the final track on the regular version of her 1984 album, Like a Virgin. <laughs> Yeah. 
different sonically than the general idea I had of early 80s Madonna going into this. Um, there's been some other tunes which I had never heard before which have fit, fit more into that um, sonic paradigm as I recalled it, which again, even the tunes that have fit in, you know, the degree to which I remembered her style was obviously a very simple and raw understanding and it's come into a bit clearer focus. Um, <clears throat> but again, that one, it had a bit different feel um, than I would have thought about if it, like someone asked me, you know, a few months ago, um, what does early 80s Madonna sound like? So um, yeah, really enjoy that one. It feels lyrically like it was basically what I was thinking. Um, that you know, someone is trying to recapture what they had with this other person. Um, it's unclear exactly where they stand, if it really has severed already, or whether it's on the edge of doing so. But either way, uh, the narrator, uh, Madonna, is saying, let's not let that happen, because we really do have true love. So whatever our problems, you know, you're not going to go out there and find someone who's going to be as good of a match. So, you know, given that we do have that match, let's try to make this work. Um, so that's what it felt like uh, thematically. Um, and yeah, lots of backing vocals, as I mentioned, both male and female. I like the layering at some different points. And I really do just love her voice and some of the lines in particular. Um, and again, I know the first couple albums, um, people have said that um, there are certain passages where they're manipulating the vocals to make them sound a bit higher and so on. Um, which is funny because, you know, some of my favorite moments are when she goes deeper and lower. Um, but ultimately, uh, I just think it's another tune where her voice sounds really good with the lead. So... Um, yeah, really cool tune. As I said, there are two bonus tracks, both extended dance remix, always something I look forward to and I'm interested in, uh, and I enjoy both of the tracks that are remixed in that fashion. So, um, yeah, looking forward to those. Once again, big shout out to Mark. Do let me know what you think of this one, and we'll see you next time. Peace.